two, 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 three. Hi guys, hearing crystal clear here. Hope all is well in your soul. Hope you're doing great. Okay. Hi, hi Nubia. Hope all is well. I hope all is well. Um, it's Friday, July 30th, 2020. That means we've almost made it through another year. Okay? <laughs> Honey, we made it through almost a year. Uh, fall harvest will be here in another day or so. It's going to be new things. I want you to know that peace is here. Okay? Have no fear. The transition has happened. We've had a shift. You should be feeling, you should be feeling refreshed. You should be feeling loved. You should be feeling like, um, oh yeah, it is Thursday, ain't it? I'm sorry. I work third. So I'm on a whole nother freaking level. I work third. Sorry. <laughs> I work third. I stay in the dark. I stay in the dark, not the light. But you should be feeling like a portal has opened and dropped you into the best best vortex that you could be right now okay you should be feeling loved you should be feeling appreciated i'm telling you peace is here okay peace is here uh i wanted to come on here and tell you a few things once again once 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 again Yes, guys, I know it's Thursday. God, uh, it's Thursday. Sorry. Can I? It's, I know it's Thursday. It's, everybody's going to remind me it's Thursday. Yeah, it's Thursday. I, I already said it was Thursday. Sorry. Sorry. All right, so anyway, everybody okay with that now? We straight now? We good? I have to talk to my people. I do lives on Facebook. So this is for my YouTube vi viewers. My, my, my Facebook viewers, you know, I have to react, interact. So basically, what I just came on here to tell you, honey, the crowd will ruin the mood in a minute. The crowd, will, that's why I'm going to stop doing lives. The crowd will ruin the mood, honey, to ruin the mood. Um, so I came on here to tell you, Okay, Hydro hydrox hydroxychloroquine is backed by Donald Trump and Bill Gates. Okay, so they are playing two sides. They are playing two sides. The, not only are they backing the vaccinations, but they are backing hydrochloroquine, okay? If you take hydrochloroquine, it's going to kill you. The side effects are blindness. The side, effect, the side effects are worse, okay, than the actual treatment of it. Do not take this shit. Those doctors getting on the front line, okay, anytime they publicize something in the mainstream media, it is a hoax. How many times do I have to tell you this? You know this. I have yet to see any of my followers, my viewers, my subscribers catch on to the government patterns of how they release the information to you and make you fall for the clickbait. Please stop falling for the clickbait. So you, so you think just because a bunch of doctors came forward and said, let's put this uh, hydrochloroquine out on the, sh uh, on the streets and get it to people? No, those doctors are just as crooked as Donald Trump and just as crooked as Bill Gates. Stop the damn games. Ain't no doctors for you. The doctors that are for you are the ones who are getting censored and getting banned. 
YouTube banning, I mean, Twitter and all them banning those doctors, that is a that is part of the hoax, okay? That is part of the shit. We all know when you're real, you get banned. We all know that. Those doctors are not real. That All that is staged. So now they got the black coon doctor up here talking to a protester, okay? And they're bantering back and forth. All those protesters are government owned and it's like a uh it's literally like a stage they put them on a stage and they act okay it is all a act for you all right so stop trusting all this crap that the government keeps throwing out to you they hate you they want to see you dead and they're gonna make sure that they get you dead they're still they still haven't told you that those masks are gonna kill you Okay, they have yet to tell you that the masks are going to kill you. Do you honestly think the same government that's taxing you 50% of your money, okay, every day of your damn life, every day of your life is going to save your life? Stop playing. There's no way in the world you could lack this much education, common sense, and self-worth. Self-worth. You don't need a degree to know when something feels wrong with you, wrong with you, okay? Putting that mask on, that's wrong. Putting a mask covering your face every day in the sweltering, smothering heat, that's wrong. Listening to your government, that is wrong. If you are in a religion, I want you to know by listening to your government, you are worshiping two masters. You are literally worshiping two masters when you listen to your government, your president, and, and do all that other crap. I will serve no other master. I refuse to serve a president. I refuse to serve a government. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? You are not to be governed. You're not to be controlled. The literal etymology of the word government is to control the people. Okay? You are grown ass adults. I don't know how many times I've seen on you guys' timeline, I'm a grown ass adult. Well, if you're really a grown ass adult, let me see you act like one and, and rebel with this government. Refuse this government. Okay? They mean you no good. How can the government mean you good when Donald Trump just gave Bill Gates $1.6 billion to fund the vaccinations? Then they turn around, Donald Trump owns the stock for hydrochloroquine, and Bill Gates just backed him. They're recycling the money back to each other. You, listen here, Trump people, it don't make sense. I don't know how much evidence that I have to give you that he's trying to kill you, and you're still going to look me dead in the eye and say, Trump 2020. It don't work. It don't work. It, it doesn't work. I can't keep allowing you to keep falling for the shenanigans. You are smarter than this. You are smarter than this. I don't care how much money, I mean, I don't care how much evidence I keep presenting to you that what they are doing is the intent to kill you. You still fall for the bullshit. How, Sway? How? 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 And then again, if you're a religious uh, person, how are you serving two masters? You cannot say, say if I was a Christian, all right? I love Jesus, and then I love Trump. You're serving two masters. You can't do it. Your only master is supposed to be the one true mother goddess or God that you serve. That's it. That's it. No president. You're not even supposed to be listening to him. You're not even supposed to be doing that. Donald Trump is the Antichrist. He's literally the last president that we'll ever have because the new world order is here. He is here. So for all you people who believe in your Christian beliefs or your, uh, uh, Islam beliefs or your Catholic beliefs or your Judaism beliefs or your Hinduism belief, okay? You're sitting up there believing in the Antichrist. You're following the Antichrist. Wake up, honey. Wake up. This dude sitting up here 
running with killers, pedophiles, and every other bad gang member in a organized crime organization, and y'all still back this guy. You still back this guy. I can't but help, but to help to say, where are your morals? You don't have morals if you keep backing a bad guy. You don't have morals if we keep throwing out the truth that this guy is straight slime ass trash and y'all sitting up there waving your flags. You're not going to tell me what to do, Trump 2020. No. No. I thought you were grown adults. Grown adults don't do this stuff. Grown adults think for themselves. None of you who are voting or backing a president is thinking for yourself. So no, you're not grown. You're still a child. You are still a child. If you are thinking the government or a president is going to save you, I am sorry. I don't care how old you are. You are still a child for needing to depend on a false government who was sent to destroy, corrupt, burn down, lie, deceit, steal, and kill. Okay? It's as simple as that. All you men, you should never follow another man. You are strong enough to lead on your own. I can't wait for the day that our real men stand up and say, I don't need a president to lead me. You're a grown ass man. You don't need another man to tell you what to do. You should be running your house. You should be governing. You should be a pillar of your community. You should be watching out for your community. We all need to be our own governors. We all need to be our own presidents. We have to stop allowing one person and one corporation run our daily lives, routine, uh, and food and everything that we do. When will it end? When? I'm sitting up here telling you, when will it end? Y'all would rather put Trump back in office Okay, then to put somebody like me in office who's going to take care of your every need. Okay, I'm tired of people giving Trump praise for him making diabetes medicine cost zero and doing small things here and there. No, if you were a good president and if you were really taking care of your people, you would approve of everything. You would approve of everything. Black people would have their rights. Okay, everybody would have their nationality. This world would be at peace. Everything, cops would be obsolete. Everything would stop. He would approve everything good. He wouldn't just approve some things or let me do this one thing for you. No, that's not a good president. No, you get no credit. If you're not going to do everything good for the people, nothing that you do will be good. You can't just say, mm, maybe... I'll give the gays rights and not the black people rights. You can't do that. And then say, oh, he's a good president. No, it does not work that way. If you don't do good all the way around the board, that will mean giving free health care to the kids, the people, uh, taxing you only one or two percent. Okay, looking out for your real rights, giving you real rights, doing what's best for you. If your president is not doing what's best for you all the way around, he's trash. Okay, he is trash. Do you understand that? Moving on, enough with that. So, a lot of people don't like the way that I cuss when I speak. Let's talk about that. You don't like the way I cuss because you're not educated to no enough to understand that cur curse words are adjectives. You're not educated enough to understand that I'm a grown-ass woman speaking to a grown-ass adult and I can say whatever the fuck I like. Okay? It eludes you. It eludes you. If you have a problem with the way that I speak, kindly escort yourself out of my presence. I'm not before your presence. You're before my presence. You ain't never got to see me again. You ain't never got to speak to me again. You ain't never got to click on my video again. Okay? Here's another thing. Do you honestly think that me cursing when I speak is going to stop me 
from getting to the heaven that I need to be. That's why you're not winning in life. Because you keep thinking just because you're cuss. And it's, I bet you this is all Christians. Just because I cuss, you probably think I'm not going to heaven. How stupid can you be? I'm sorry, spirit. Dang it. They do stupid shit. Can I? I'm sorry. I, I'm supposed to stop saying, calling people stupid. Okay. Goddess, the mother goddess created me. She created me this way. Do you honestly think she's not going to place me in heaven because of my adjectives that I use? And to be, and to be correct, the only cuss word there ever is, is damn. Did you know that? You didn't know that because you're not educated enough to know that. Okay, well, this is what I do. I educate, okay? The only curse word there ever is in the world is damn. So fuck off. <laughs> ah! I do what I want to, and I'll say what I want to. If you don't like how this message is presented to you, Small message for you. It's as simple as that. This is hearing crystal clear here with the uncensored raw truth. Yes, 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 yes. I say what I want to, I do what I want to, and you mad because I'm me. Oh well, you better find another truther because I give it to you straight. I don't sugarcoat shit. You don't pay me, you don't run me. You don't, you, you just don't pay me. You just don't pay me. Sean, I don't care how you feel. I don't care how any of you feel. This is me. If you don't like the way I'm presenting something, excuse yourself it's as simple as that you don't have to be here why are you here okay i'm not gonna be fake i'm not gonna pretend to be anyone else if you were sitting next to me just like this honey i would talk to you just as is i'm not fake i will never ever ever be fake and i refuse to be fake to make you feel comfortable <laughs> I'm tired. No, I don't accommodate anyone. I don't accommodate anyone, okay? You must be out your brain. I don't tell y'all how to wear them damn masks. I damn sure don't tell you how to think. I damn sure don't tell you how to be. But if you think me cussing is going to stop me from getting into heaven, then you don't know your God and you definitely damn sure don't know my goddess. This is how I was created. They know about me. Hell, matter of fact, they said, you know what? When you make crystal, add that spice and that fire and that, that love, that soul in her and drop them F-bombs in that beautiful baby right there. They gave this to me, baby. So you mad because I got blessed? And on top of that, I'm good with my words, son. Okay, I'm good with my words. So what were you saying? I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. I couldn't hear you because I couldn't care. All right? So that's the shorty gist of it. You stop thinking that adjectives are not going to get you to heaven. How brainwashed are you? This is the same crowd that thinks that if you're gay, you're not going to get to heaven. Really? What's wrong with y'all? Y'all have, man, bro. Bro. You can't, you got to stop thinking about, you got to stop thinking like this. Please stop thinking like this. It is crazy. God, okay? Okay, God created you. Do you honestly say, think he's saying, you can't come in here with all that cussing. You ain't coming up in here with all that cussing. What the hell you doing? Get out of here with all that cussing. He created it, okay? He created it. So stop being ignorant. You're holding yourself back when you're watching others, okay, be themselves. Go be yourself. You want to cuss too. Deep down inside, you want to cuss too. You want to cuss too. One day you're going to get there. 
One day you're going to get there. Stop saying God don't accept gays. Yes, God do. Stop saying that shit. You sound ignorant as hell. God created them people. God created that people. And if you really want to talk about it, okay, when you were born, the government has been inje injecting atrazine into people to turn them gay. Do you honestly think just because the government turned these people gay that God is not going to accept them in heaven? You have to be out your damn mind. You have to be out your damn mind if you don't think that gay people are not a child of God. Those are his creations, not yours. Not yours. Who are you to say that somebody is not getting into heaven because a man wrote it in the Bible? A plagiarized fake Bible that was stolen from the real, okay, from the real mother goddess. You better stop, uh, you better stop con condemning God's people before you condemn yourself. Stop condemning God's people before you condemn yourself. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Only good people are going to get into heaven. It does not matter if you're gay, if you cuss, okay, if you're black or if you're white. If you are good, you are going to heaven. If you cuss, you are going to heaven. If you are white, you are going to heaven. Okay? Stop being stupid. Uh-uh, I'm going to say it this time, spirit. Fuck that. No, they need to hear it. The gloves are coming off. They need to hear it. No, you need to hear it. Those are his children. You better take your hands off his children. You better take your judgment off his children. Because the same finger you judge those people with, it's the same finger that God will condemn you with. You better stop it. You better stop it. All right? That's enough of that. And I don't care who like it. I don't care who likes it. Okay? I don't care. Your opinion, that is your opinion opinion god is not gonna stop his children for coming up there for liking sex a certain way you are wrong you are brainwashed and you need to go sit with yourself and get right do you understand what i'm saying to you and if you can't accept god's children god will not accept you the end it's the end you understand that all right, so now that that got that out there, here's another edition of Hearing Crystal Clear. I'm laying this, I'm, I'm laying this shit down raw, uncensored. If you don't like it, unfollow, unsubscribe. It's as simple as that, because I will not be anything else but me damn self. I will be me damn self all day long, okay? That's it. That's it. You don't get anything else. You get this. You get this. This is what you're stuck with. If you don't like me, hearing crystal clear here for President 2020. If you don't like anything, what? Hey, what did what did Will Ferrell what did Will Ferrell say? And Talladega Nights. If you ain't chewing big red, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I love you guys. You know what? Let me put some good energy your way because y'all tripping. Y'all tripping. Y'all mad because I'm shining and I'm doing shit. I got to tune myself up. Y'all Y'all are just, ooh, Lord. Lord, 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 Lord. Oh, it's backwards. Let me help you, Justin. I got you, fam. Say no more. Say no more. I got you. Hold on. Did that help? Did I do it? <laughs> oh my God, I did it. <laughs> thank you guys. I just wanna thank the Academy for helping me with my curse words. They, they are amazing. They keep me going in life. They really push me and move me along. It makes me a better person every time I release me, okay? I love you guys. Go be great. That was just a friendly reminder, okay? 
That was a friendly reminder. I love you. You're amazing. Don't you stop being you. Don't you let nobody tell you what to do. Hey, and Crystal Clear here. I'm out, bitches.